When I was growing up, my mother taught me the golden rule. Perhaps you were taught the same? I came across this golden rule again when I read Jesus' words in Luke chapter 6, verse 31. Do to others as you would like them to do to you. I found that I haven't quite learned the lesson. In fact, as the Holy Spirit began to review my test grade on this exam, I realized a couple truths about my misunderstanding and misapplication of the golden rule. You see, the golden ruler uses an active verb, not a passive verb. An active verb is all about the subject performing the action, while a passive verb is all about the action being done to the subject. Well, in this golden rule, I'm the subject and I am to do the action. But how many times have I practiced this in life as a passive verb? Do to others as they have done, or as you predict they will do to you. Oh, how often I have exercised the golden rule in my life passively. How about you? Felt like I was practicing the golden rule by not saying or doing something mean, but read the rule again. Do to others as you would like them to do to you. Exercising the golden rule means actively loving others. Instead of just resisting negative actions, we're called to do, to initiate, and to assert positive blessings for others regardless of what they have done or what you think they might do. And Jesus, of course, is the perfect fulfillment of the golden rule. In fact, when he took the exam, he passed with a 100%. The reality of the golden rule is that it is a response to His love coming to us first, yet while we were still sinners. And because of His love, we can also love actively and love others. So get out His ruler and start measuring your day. This is discipleship, following Jesus, being changed by Jesus, and committing to the mission and the love of Jesus. So be golden today. Let's pray. Lord, would you bring that love to us again today? Forgive us for the times where we have not passed the exam of what you expect and what you've called us to be and how you've expected and called us to live. So often we have lived passively and just reacted in response to what other people have done. But here you have clearly called us this day to lead out, to initiate, and to assert and show your love by being active to give that love to others. And so help us to really apply this in our day today. We ask this in Jesus' name, amen.